Hey guys, welcome back to another Pouring on Records from my ongoing series. This is super exciting. I use Golden Fluid and today I'm going for Dioxide Purple Yum and Pyrrol Orange. So my two favorite colors with some uh, cloud mix recipe with the titanium white. And I think I might use some gold also. So yep, yeah. and if you're interested in knowing how I finish these off because I finish them with resin and then I frame them with frames from Ikea. I already have a video on that that I did a few months ago. You can uh, check that out and that's it. I'm gonna set myself up and I am going for this. Okay, so today's color palette, I have enough paint for a few records, um, maybe two or three. I have some pyrrol orange, some dioxide purple, some titanium white with the satin enamels. This is all golden fluid except the satin enamels added into there. And some iridescent bright gold. Um, I might mix up another color. I don't know. So the more I do these records, the more I remember how I used to work with Golden Fluid. It's like every time I stop for a long time and I come back, I remember the mistakes that I had made, which is one major thing is to not use too much paint, to not cover it all up, that's for sure. <clears throat> The blow dryer does the magic in this, really. I think this is my favorite cloud mix, the one with the, the golden fluid. Since the artist loft changed their recipe and I can't use my same recipe as before. I also do like when there's a lot of white How about we go and give it some gold? There, even that's a lot of paint. They're so thin. They continue moving around so much afterwards that there has to not be too much. A bit more white here actually it's too cloudy it's too airy I want it to be cloudy thing about this pyro orange that costs a damn fortune is that it's transparent I think if I'm not mistaken so these for those of you who are new to my channel purple and orange are my two favorite colors I cannot say it enough Eyegasms and eyegasms all over the place. So the white is what helps create cells here because if you don't, if there wasn't the satin enamels, the cell, they wouldn't be cells, actually. It's extremely hard to get cells with golden fluid. I'm not saying it's impossible, 
but usually all the times I've gotten cells with the blow dryer, it would they would um, they would disappear in time, and sucks, really sucks. So, okay, here we go. Look how transparent. I blew on it to fill up near the center. You can literally see the sticker through. And you know what? I think I'm finding that pretty cool. At first when I did the records, it bugged me, but now, no way. I think that's what's cool about this, is that you can actually see the sticker through, you know? Okay, I have to not touch that. But I do want some more cells here. I'm not liking this side here. It's just that that side that's bugging me. I'm just gonna now I'm gonna leave it like that okay stopping stopping <clears throat> I have paint enough uh, for another one so I'm gonna get oh I have to take out the tape even though the paint isn't flowing through I'm loving it now. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. This is good. And you can still see through there. Very cool. Okay, I'll set up for the next one. All right, I'm really loving that huge amount of negative space orange on the other one. Uh, wait, no, I'm gonna go. A lot of gold in this one. I think if I'm careful, I might have enough for another one. That's probably what I'm gonna do here. Dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no, I don't have enough for another one. I'm gonna put some purple here. <clears throat> and then... A little bit of white here. There, that's it. There's something about that last blow there that created that line that for some reason I don't want to break it. I don't want to undo what I did there. 
So I'm just going to fill up the sides. Alright you guys, so I'm back. This is the first one that I did. I love how there's a little bit of gold that shimmers in between. Got some really, really beautiful cells on this one. The purple reacts really well. Sorry. Yep. First one, this one has a lot of white. I really like it. Then the second one that has a lot of orange, which I love, and a lot of fogginess slash airiness. Not a lot of cells in this one, but I'm really, really still enjoying it. But you guys know me, I don't give a crap really about cells. They're just really fun to have, but not always. Composition is what's important. <clears throat> Sorry, you guys. I'm at the end of my COVID here. God, like two weeks now. This is the last one. And my favorite. The composition is insane. Let's go in for some details. mega clouds in this one and then some mini ones the tape is ruining the view <laughs> all right stay tuned for the final result i'm gonna resin all of these back with the final result on my soon to call famous kitchen floor as this is the best place in my condo to show you guys what a resin finish looks like without too much reflection so I think it's gonna be hard to choose okay they all have something no this one's my fave <laughs> but they all have something really special this one has a lot of orange negative space. Love. Um, and if this is your first time seeing these, once they are resined and framed, it's hard to film because the reflection is, is it, there's like a double reflection. So this one, holy lordy lord. Now, if this is in the sun, Everything that's gold really, really shimmers. It's insane. It's insane. And then the last one, this is the one, like this one has a lot of puffy cells, like clouds, and this is the one that has the most cells though. Like this area here on the right. Love it. Oh, I love the purple. I love them all. Once again, I'm gonna ask you guys to choose and let me know if you have a favorite. Which one is your favorite? It's always interesting to me to know. Um, so that's it, hope you guys like this. Have a good one.